how do I create a copy sketch? It's really hard in Fusion 360. I would agree. Fusion 360 is a little bit tricky, and I've found that I've wasted a lot of time. So in this example, I have this combined object that is two different sketches extruded into one another. So what I want to do is create the first sketch, and now I want the second sketch, and it's effectively the same thing, but just reoriented. So how do we do that? I found that, you know, Command C or Control C if you're on a Windows machine, if you select it and then try to paste it, it just doesn't work. So what I do instead is select the entire sketch itself, hit Control C, start a brand new sketch. Select the face or the plane that you want to use. The new sketch starts. Now I hit Control V or Command C, depending on what type of machine you're on. It will paste this in. And now that it's done that, I can reorient it to the location that I want. So I can use the rotate and I can use, you know, the move command. So I get this kind of reoriented, but I can see that it is upside down. So I used rotate and now I'm going to, you know, kind of move this over. But now I want to mirror this over. So how do we use the mirror tool? Draw a line off to the side. You can make it construction line for simplicity, but I think the solid line will be fine. I can select this group of entities and I'll go up and find mirror in the sketch command. So the mirror. I want to make sure I have everything selected from the sketch itself. So I'm going to use this left trending box because it'll grab everything that it touches. And then I'll select a mirror line. It sketches the new mirror for me. Now select the entity I don't want. I could make this construction or I can just delete it. Now use the move command and select and move this over where this goes. And now we have the two sketches that are copies of each other. Hope that helps. I'll see you guys in the next video.